Welcome back. It's pet adoption time, and we're here with Rex Welton with the Precise Humane Society. We've got kitties and a dog today, right? And right. Betty. Thanks, Betty. <laughs> Let's talk about Sassy first. She's about five months old, and she's a pit mix, and she is just a really, really sweet, wonderful dog. She's also five months old, so she's not going to get a lot bigger, so she's going to be a medium size, which is a great size, mm -hmm. not too big and not too small. She's very playful. She's very energetic. She would be great with somebody who likes to be outside a lot or with a, a family with children, and then she would obviously love to be inside at night and cuddle, especially at night like tonight. She certainly knows how to make television, get on television. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what about the kitties? I've got a brother and sister here, Lily and Hollis. They have another sister back at the Humane Society. They pretty much all look identical. They're about eight weeks old, and they are very, very calm for eight weeks, very attentive, and they're also somewhat unusual. Usually this late into the winter, we don't have young kittens yet. They're usually born around April, so if somebody wants some young kittens, these might be two of them. All right, you are telling people to make sure they get those animals. Yeah, in. obviously tonight is going to be extremely cold. I'd say for the next three nights and even days, try to get your pets inside. If you can't bring them inside, at least get them in a garage or in a basement somewhere where they're protected from the, the cold temperatures and the wind. Are you hearing horror stories already? Not yet, but I'm afraid that we will get some phone calls. You know, domestic animals, cats and dogs, they are real similar to us, to humans, and they get cold just like we do. And um, it's really, really important that people bring them inside. If they have to stay outside, make sure they're protected from the wind. And if they have a water bowl, it's going to freeze really, really quickly. So add fresh water as often as possible. All right, so what do people do to get it, these adapted? Best thing to do is stop by the Humane Society. We're at 61 Miller Street, or folks can visit our website or site humane.org. All right, and of course, we've got more information about pet adoption on WXII12.com.